need to focus right now. Oh, hey, excuse me. What? Are you kidding me right now? I'm sorry, man. I'm just like kind of powerless when it comes to yoga pants, you know? Let's get you out of this parking lot. You have a visible erection. You think you can ride with that? I don't know. I just want to say really quickly, thank you for ruining yoga pants for me. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't think I can ever wear them again without oh. Pontius' voice. Oh, <laughs> you, would look, you would look so good in yoga pants. <laughs> oh my god, I know. Okay, oh I, I hope I can overcome it. So mm. Dax, I know you wrote and directed the movie, yeah. but I believe you were writing another script while the idea of making chips came yeah. up. How was the process of saying I'm going to make it a badass movie? Well, um, so I've, I, in this other script I was writing, I made a, a Poncharello joke, but I can't spell Poncharello, so I Googled it, and the first image that popped up was this this picture of John and Ponch, like real tight shot above the shoulders, and their helmets kind of like staring off, really tough looking, and I had never really seen them like that. I remembered more of the TV show, and I thought, wow, there's like a Lethal Weapon, Bad Boys version of this movie just sitting there to be made, and then I went to this... Warner Brothers and begged them, and they said yes. Shocker. Cool. Yeah. And how did you guys connect it? I mean, did you met before a mutual that? friend? A mutual friend uh, texted me that he had this my TV movie. sister. Okay. TV sister Erica Christensen, who's I want to say Erica Strada. I was like, Erica, on the tip of my tongue. Yeah. Erica, Erica, Erica Strada. Strada Christensen. <laughs> um, and I met him, uh, you know, for breakfast, and. Uh, but you had the script. The script. No, 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 no. I had just, just sold just the, the idea. idea. Yeah. Okay. Just the idea, oh. and, he, and and I sold the idea to the studio, saying, and then Michael Pena oh. will be punched. He oh. has to be. Punched. And I had no idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I oh, never, really? never, never met like, him. Mm, but home. the meeting was almost like, you have to do this. Yeah. <laughs> I sold this with you in it. So. And you immediately said. Well, no. I mean, he, he just like right away. I was like, oh, I can definitely do a movie with this guy. Oh, Sometimes okay. you just don't like. I swear to God, he can be a nice person. The other person, can, and you just don't get along. It just it's right. one of those. And I think you you might punch completely yours. Was it a struggle to feel in, into Eric Estrada's shoes, or was it easy to? Bring um, the I don't feel to like you? I, I I went into Eric Estrada's shoes. I just feel like I I wanted to punch his shoes. Oh, cool. You know, I guess that's what we wanted to do because I'm like you know, that's like me trying to play like you know, Robert De Niro, right. try to imitate him. I'm like it's not never gonna happen. He's his own person. You know, a punch. Uh, you know, uh, Eric Estrada made it his own, so I, I figured I might as well do the same thing. No, I, and I John Baker, I don't think, was a pill addict on the TV show. No, I don't <laughs> no, think so. No, no, I, no, I, no, I, don't, I don't think, think so. so. I, didn't I love both characters, but do, would you define them as a John and Punch love romantic storyline throughout the movie? Romantic? Yeah, I it don't is. know. Like, yeah, I just felt they wanted to be together. Story. It's, it's a, a love story, story. right? Yeah, yeah. It's when Harry met Sally. They get together and they're like this, and then all of a sudden they're like, wait, we're like this. Yeah, and and would you define when Harry met Harry? When Harry met Harry. Harry met Harry. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I just wanted them to be together forever. So that's why yeah. I thought maybe it's the romantic storyline. And we laugh, but we also saw, you know, villains, a serious plot. Would you define the story more as a comedy or as an action type bad boys movie? For me, it's definitely that. It's action. I wanted that to be like kind of the signature thing of this movie that the You'd never seen motorcycle stunts like this. You know, the, the bad guy's scary as hell. It's, you know, D'Onofrio who's the best bad guy in the business. So just keeping all the stakes real, I think, makes the comedy that much more fun because right. it's relieving tension all the time. You know, there's that moment on the bridge and watching the audience, like, they're they're screaming and then they're laughing and then, yeah. oh, no, he's a... And, the, you know, like, watching them go like this was is just the greatest thing ever. That's true. Thank you, guys. Much success. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank, all thank you. All right, thank you. <laughs> I need to get into some warm water. I'm not going to carry you there. I saved your life oh yesterday. Oh, my God. I knew you were going to bring it up. Grab me and get it over Fine. with. Did you face plant in my... No, 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 no. There was no contact. I could have swore I felt either your nose or your lips. Nope. I might have been like a, like a little bit of contact. <laughs>